uh, plastics issues up at the state level as well. Mr. Kaporian. Thank you, Kristen. Good morning, everyone. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. And it is a great morning, isn't it? Yes. Today, we're going to make history. And you know, we've, as, as Kirsten said, I've been involved in this issue for many years at Sacramento uh, and now here in the council. And I want to first congratulate uh, my friend and longtime colleague, Paul Koretz, for finally moving this forward. And to council member Wezar and Reyes and Garcetti uh, for being the champions that they are and finally getting us to this point and standing up to these tired old arguments that we continue to hear in opposition to this ban. And you know we're going to hear it. We're going to hear it again tomorrow. You're going to see it in blogs. You're going to see it in the press. You're going to see people saying, why is the city council bothering with things like plastic bags when we have so many more important things to do? When we have a budget crisis, when we have all this serious stuff going on, why are they bothering with bags? Well, let me tell you, if those people knew that the city of Los Angeles spends five or six or more million dollars a year, every year, cleaning up plastic bags instead of spending that money on parks and ambulances and on youth development and on police, they would say, this is the time to ban plastic bags. Sharon, come on over here. Sharon, come on over here. If those people could see marine life like this that dies on our beaches because it's starving, because it's ingested plastic bags and can't consume food, they know that this is the time to ban plastic bags. If those people walked through our neighborhoods and saw every fence and every tree festooned with this litter blighting our neighborhoods and dragging down our quality of life, they know this is the time to ban plastic bags. You know, Throughout the history of this city, this city has been inextricably linked to the Pacific Ocean. The ocean has been part of our heart and soul. It's been the foundation of our industry. It's created jobs. It's been the reason that people travel around the world to come to Los Angeles because of our beautiful beaches, because that's, what, that's how we're identified throughout the world. So throughout our long history, Los Angeles has depended upon the oceans. Well, today, the ocean is depending upon Los Angeles. Today, the ocean that's, that's being choked with plastic contamination is depending on Los Angeles and depending on this city council to act today. And that's what we're going to do. I thank you all for being out here. I thank you for your continuing advocacy. Keep pushing.